Hello, everybody. Welcome to this special bonus video for Persona 5 Royal. Joining me again is Game With. Hello. And, uh, let's get things going. Hey there. Good job. Since you're Egg here, boy? Does that mean you're ready Egg to boy. Me now? Egg boy. Thanks. Yeah, this one kind of caught me off guard, so I couldn't get the explanation cutscene. Bottom line, he's hit a roadblock with his studies. And he learned that people vent their emotions when they fight, so he's having us fight him. Don't expect me to hold back. Pedal to the metal. Okay. Deja vu. Yeah, he opens the fight with this. He opens the fight with drifting. Yep. So what you're about to see is me being incredibly fucking OP, but... Make no mistake, this guy is a force to be reckoned with. I mean, that that was just a, a flick in the nuts right there for damage. Yeah, pretty much. Oh, and he has a move later that's so much worse. Oh dear. Also, he's got uh, Rivers in the Desert playing. Yep. It's apparently become the just de facto boss fight music, which I'm okay with. Poor Morgana. <laughs> He's just completely frozen. The best thing is you can see like slight movement from him too. Uh-huh. Also, Ketchy's not doing too hot. No, he is not. Then Futaba. No damage at all. Nope. Request denied. <laughs> Ready to go. Mona's fully powered. It's just like, all right, you little bastard. This is how I really feel. Oh, thanks. I'm going to kill you with love and bullets <laughs> <laughs> and a bomb. Mm-hmm. Morgana's still like, oh, I feel a little woozy there, guys. <laughs> oh, yeah, I should probably mention his weaknesses. Um, I'm pretty sure he's immune to status ailments. He's also resistant to physical damage, but... Well, like physical, physical damage, but other than that, pretty much anything's fair game. Which is why you're using Almighty. Well, it just happened to be a really strong skill. Mm -hmm. uh, like, boy, hey, I sure boy, hope... that, that's a bit <laughs> weird for you to say. It's like, boy, I sure Ow, hope this doesn't awaken anything hurts, in me. But it's so good. <laughs> Boy, I sure hope this doesn't awaken anything in me. Persona! I sure hope not. <laughs> Persona. Persona! And then Persona 6 comes out and something's just got him fucked up. <laughs> oh dear. I really understand how you feel now. Thank you. Now, it's time to show you how I feel. Oh boy. This is what I've learned from studying humans. Witness my true feelings. Huh. Ow. Oh, man. Yeah, that was definitely true feelings, all right. Uh, here we go. Yeah, when he uses that, generally speaking, it's a good idea to guard. And you're about to see why. Not bad, right? 
Yikes! Yeah, he hits like a truck. Freaking egg boy. Which is ironic, because he's in a car. Also, do you missed? Yep. And this is why I keep Morgana on the team. Usually. <laughs> I mean, that Talmation skill is already really good. Yep. Which is why I love putting it on Personas the Joker can use. Because <laughs> it just makes my life easier. That it does. He's setting up for more fireworks. That he is. Jose is watching. I'm I'm watching you. Gotta love it. Yeah, one of the, one of the great things about uh, Izanami, Izanami, Izanagi no Okami, uh, his special ability increases attack and defense based on you, the completion rate of your Persona Compendium. Huh. Also, take that egg boy. Yep. And with that out of the way, I leveled up. There's also one more fight in this video, which we will see in just a moment here. After I apparently decide where to put this ability. Hmm. I think I get rid of Diamond Dust for this one. Oh, would you like that? Even this one can get friggin' uh, salvation. <laughs> yep. Ow. Good job all around. Sorry about that. I'm awfully beat. What a coincidence. <laughs> Me too. Thanks to all of you, I... Ooh, did you learn something new? I'm pretty sure I understand humans less than ever. <laughs> oh. Uh? Oh. I was anticipating he'd say the exact opposite. Yeah, I was hoping things would end on a happy note here. Well, this is an issue. I'm sorry we couldn't help you. Why are you sorry? Well, you did say you understand humans even less now and all. That's great news. What do you mean? Humans aren't the easiest to comprehend. That's why they can get lost and look for other people they trust. Sometimes they even try to accomplish the impossible with those people, like you all just tried to do for me. Now I'm sure that's what it means to be human. So, it's impossible to learn everything about humans in such a short time. Oh, hey, Jose, you know what another thing that us humans like to do? Love them. Steal your car. Was to your <laughs> satisfaction. That buggy is mine now. <laughs> I can go back to that person whenever I want. Oh boy, vagueness. Hey, Jose, who's this person you keep mentioning? And while we're at it, who are you? I... I am me. I'm Jose, a boy who got a little smarter because I met all of you. No matter who we are, we're always searching for ourselves. Just remember... You know, judging by the yellow eyes, it would be safe to assume that he has something to do with the Velvet Room. So it's entirely pers possible that this one person they keep talking about is Igor. For now. Possibly. On the other hand, this is Persona, where there's always this looming feeling of something bigger. Here, take this. Mega Igor. Mega Igor. <laughs> Star water tray. 
So supposedly that actually helps you collect more flowers. Oh humans. No wonder the others just can't leave them be. Hey, what's that supposed to mean? Don't worry, it's nothing. See you guys. Thank you so much. Just like I hope you'll still have to collect flowers too. Off I go. Good job. You know, the funny thing is you can actually come back here and ask him questions. But I really understand uh -huh. what just happened, but for as truthfully as he answers, problem. you don't actually get any real answers okay. out of him. He may be weird, well. but he sure is a cute little kid. Because once again, vagueness. Hey, I'm cute too. <laughs> Meanwhile, the kitchen's just like yeah, Morgana. All right, should be switching over any sec. Yep, there it is. Hello, Reaper. How are you doing, buddy? He's about to be not so good in a second. I don't feel too good. <laughs> I really do like the design the Reaper has here. It's, it's pretty cool. It's pretty badass looking. Yep. And you look at the comically large barrels on those revolvers, and you're like, oh. Yep. I feel so powerful. What you foretold, you never see it coming. Windbreak. Goodbye. Bye, Reaper. Trophy earned. Unsurpassed rubble. It'd be awesome if you could take him as Persona, though. That'd be badass. With this power. Lend me your strength. Hey, Salvation. would you look at that? Salvation. Goodbye, Inferno. I also didn't realize that this persona had victory cry. Yep. It's not just Satanile. Mm-hmm. Anyway, that is, I believe, the end of the video. So thank you guys so much for joining us. Hope you enjoyed this Let's Play, and we'll see you guys next time. With whatever it is next. Yep.